So this is the engine out of a 1943, it could be a 42, I'm not sure, Ford 9N tractor. So I haven't seen any good videos that were actually clear that showed how to take the valves out and I could have used it before I did this. So I figured I'd give a little video. So this is the valve assembly. And in that valve assembly is this little clip and it goes in like that and it sits in the motor like that, right? So in that hole, you can see that silver just sticking out is that right there. And you have to depress that in order to pull this clip off the valve assembly. So remember, it's sitting in there like that. So this is the top, sitting there just like that. So there's lots of tricks and tools you can use on the internet, but I'm using this. And so this is a Ford tire iron. I believe it came with an old pickup truck I had. And if you notice, it's got that little extra bit at the end that flares up. And the real tool is a lot like that. There's just a fork in it, but this works pretty well. And so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna stick this in the exhaust manifold port. Yeah and push down on it, like that. See how it went down? Okay. Let's see if I can this one. A little more. And then I'm gonna press it, and I'm gonna pull this clip out. There it is there. And then release the tension. Put it in my well-marked spot. And then sometimes these are sticky to get out, so they might need a little persuasion. You get a little screwdriver in there, do a little tap tap like that. And there it is. And the whole assembly comes out just like that. And then pop that out. And then there's your little lifter there. And that comes right out. And there you go. And that's how you do that.